ey, da die zwei Windelpackungen nicht da sind, habe ich das Gefühl, habe ich echt, kann ich jetzt echt gut packen. So, it is our last full day here in Sweden. The sun is shining, we clean everything up. We are having a goodbye party with the Swedish um, group and tomorrow we are headed home. Between those apple trees we had a little scavenger hunt that the Swedish people prepared for us. And then we had, this is apple cider, they prepared some apple cider and a really nice dinner for us at that little restaurant on our property. And this is actually where we had the dinner, they celebrate weddings in here as well. And we had this nice buffet, lots of vegan options for me as well, which was really awesome. Over here we had the salad bar and then they gave us some nice cream for dessert and they made nice cream just for me vegan and sugar-free that's mine so awesome so it is the last day we are leaving in a few hours last time i'm going to uh, the store to get some vegan snacks for the trip back to germany so this is it two months are over in sweden when we first got here, these houses over there in the street and stuff were not there. There's this huge construction for two months and all of a sudden there's houses there. So I think next time we come here, there will be a huge new building complex right here. This is where we stayed, in there. So the shop is right over there and this is the place that we stayed at Ruzeng Inn. And on the right is the office building, and then if you go straight ahead to the um, complex, this is the bed and breakfast we stayed in. And I noticed I never did a room tour, so this is our little bathroom. We were the only room who had a bathroom attached, so because we had the little boy Liam. This is the door, my bed, and then from the other side, the, the couch where Liam slept on. The bed of Selena and mine and a little tiny cupboard. Yeah, that's our tiny room. Bye! And I made it back home to Berlin. I'm finally home after two months in Sweden.